Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer and House Speaker Mike Johnson unveiled a bipartisan stopgap funding bill, referred to as a continuing resolution, CR, aimed at preventing a government shutdown. This CR, maintaining current funding levels, proposes extending shutdown deadlines to March 1st and March 8th. The agreement, brokered by Schumer, Johnson, House Minority Leader Hakeem Jeffries, Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell, and the White House, necessitates bipartisan cooperation for timely passage before the looming January 19th deadline. While Schumer expressed optimism, emphasizing the bipartisan approach to address critical national challenges, the bill faces opposition, notably from the House Freedom Caucus, raising doubts about securing Republican support. Johnson defended the CR, portraying it as essential to House Republicans' goals emphasizing the need to move away from omnibus governance and achieve meaningful policy wins while responsibly managing tax dollars. Despite Johnson's pitch, the right flank of the House Republican Conference signaled resistance, with the House Freedom Caucus dismissing the proposal as surrender. The opposition stems from a strategic view that funding deadlines offer opportunities to extract concessions on spending and border policies from the Democratic Senate and White House. This reluctance poses challenges for Johnson, who must navigate a divided party and potentially contend with dissatisfaction similar to the situation faced by former House Speaker Kevin McCarthy. The introduction of yet another CR comes amid congressional struggles to reach funding agreements, with little progress reported. Johnson's earlier announcement of a top-line funding deal with President Joe Biden and Schumer, amounting to $1.59 trillion drew mixed reactions within the GOP, while Johnson lauded the deal for cutting $10 billion from the IRS and reclaiming $6 billion in unspent COVID relief funds. Some House Republicans expressed dissatisfaction, sparking speculation about potential leadership changes. The precarious situation hints at underlying tensions within the Republican Party and Johnson's decision to pursue a CR contradicts his previous commitment to avoid short-term funding measures. As the House Republican Conference aspires to escape such funding uncertainties, the willingness of Democrats' support becomes pivotal for the CR's success in the House, posing a challenge to Johnson's leadership and party unity.